So now we're going to see about plotting this orientation of an f. Um, first, I'm not entirely happy with my markers. I've selected them all here. They're a little bit thick, so I'm going to uh, thin them down um, by reducing their weight, let's say, to uh, three quarters of a point. I think that will make them a little more precise. Um, so uh, we're looking for a point that is uh, trending just east of north, and it's going to be moderately plunging, so it's going to plot somewhere here uh, in the net. Uh, so the first thing that we need to do is to rotate the net, and we need to rotate it seven degrees, and we can do that freehand here. Um, we can get pretty close to seven degrees, uh, but if you don't want to do it that way, we can undo, and we can go into the Arrange menu, go down to Rotate, more rotation options, and that brings up a sidebar in which we can actually rotate by typing in a number or by clicking, in this case, seven times. Uh, so there's our net rotated 7 degrees, and now we want to get hold of a marker. So if this were a horizontal line, it would be right here on the primitive, the outer edge of the net. But it's a plunging line, so it's plunging 10, 20, 30, 40, 42 degrees, and that puts it right there. And so that's where it plots, and if you want, you can uh, return the net horizontal. And there you have the plot of a line with trend 007 and plunge 42.